What if I told you that you were just one digital product away from life-changing money, life-changing freedom, life-changing options so that you can live the life that you and your family deserve and desire to live? Well, in this training, I'm gonna be sharing with you why digital products are the number one best, most simplest, most incredible way to make money online this year better than any other option out there. And honestly, trust me, I, I know, I've been there, I've done that. Me and my wife, we've built multiple successful businesses in real estate, in marketing agencies, consulting agencies, in uh, <laughs> intellectual property in publishing, all kinds of different spheres, e-commerce. We had a great e-commerce uh, business, but here's what I wanna tell you. Knowing what I know now, if I had to start over, I wouldn't start with any of those. I would go straight for digital products because Digital products are the best opportunity that is available to us today, right now. A number of years ago, I have some really great friends, me and my wife, have a wonderful couple friend, um, and they were pastors, okay? They were working at this small church, and you know, if you know anything about the, the charity or nonprofit or pastoral world, okay, it could be rough out there sometimes financially, right? And so they're serving, they weren't the head pastors, but they were they were uh, staff pastors on there. They're serving, they're like, like working super hard, but because the church was small, they weren't able to pay them what they were worth. So guess what? My buddy had to go out there and drive Uber just to make ends meet for his family, who by the way at the time was living in a small two bedroom apartment with them and their three kids. Like they were struggle bussing, man, for here in America, it was rough for them, right? And they didn't know what they were gonna do. Well, guess what? They put together, they learned about digital products, they built a digital product, and then they started telling people about their digital product. And here's the crazy part. Okay, come with me here to the board. Check this out. You're never gonna believe this. When within one hour, okay, they, they built their digital product, which I'm gonna talk about here in a second. They built their digital product and they got a, a few friends together and they told them about it for an hour. And in that one hour, my friends made $105,000 in one hour. Like what? You wanna talk about collapsing time? Like one of the reasons why so many people stay broke, they stay in scarcity, is because they are trying to make money on old operating systems. I say it like this. Too many people are trying to make a fortune in the present by trying to make a living in the past. What does that mean? Listen, the opportunities that worked for my parents, for your parents, for our grandparents, it may have been good for them, but I'm telling you this right now, it doesn't mean that it's good for us today. What operating system am I talking about? What old opportunities am I talking about? I'm talking about go to school, go to college, get a job, right? Like climb the corporate ladder, save, work super hard, work for 40 or 50 years, 40 to 50 hours a week, every single week, and then hopefully one day whenever you're old and gray, you might have enough money to retire tire on. But check this out. With digital products, just like my friends here, you could literally take the knowledge, the experience, the expertise that you already have, okay? You're going you're gonna to create these products one time, and here in a minute, I'm going to give you some examples, okay? You create the products one time, and then you put them out there to solve people's problems. You do the work once, and then they pay you over and over and over again. I mean, think about this. For like some pastors at a small church who like were barely making enough to get by by working at the church and driving Uber to within one hour made $105,000. Like if that's not life changing, I don't know what is, right? And the cool part is, is if it happened for them, it can also happen for you. One more story and then I'm gonna get into some of the details of this, okay? So my wife and I, we started building a business. This was a number of years ago, probably six or seven years ago now. We were building one of our businesses and man, it was a grind. It was like so hard and we were doing all these services and we were trying to serve people with, with our time and with our effort, which nothing wrong with that. But here's the problem with only making money with your time and your effort. Again, come with me here to the board, check this out. Okay, most people, this is a clock by the way, okay? Most people, the only way that they know how to make money is with their time right? Like their time and their effort, right? They're like, well, man, if I want to make more money, I got to pick up a couple extra shifts. I got to put in some overtime, right? That's how, that's how most people only know how to make money. And the problem with this is, is you get trapped into this vicious 
never ending cycle of if you want more money, you have to trade more time and more effort. And honestly, this is where my wife and I were uh, six or seven years ago in, the, in one of our businesses that we were building. And we were stuck. We were like, man, what are we gonna do? Because we were fulfilling a lot of our business with our time and our effort. And we were just like, to our wits end, this is so tough because in order to scale, in order to like serve more people and to make more money, you if you're only doing this model by trading your time and your effort, then you're capped out. Everyone only has so much time. Everyone only has so much effort. And we were just absolutely like maxed out, stressed out. Like it was hard, right? And it wasn't until we discovered digital products that everything changed for us, okay? So here's what happened. We went from the model that we were on, just trading our time for dollar, just doing it for ourselves instead of a job somewhere, which is better than having a job, right? Nothing wrong with having a job, but it, you know, if you give somebody the ability to feed you, AKA if you become an employee, then you also give that person the ability to starve you, AKA you never know what's gonna happen. You never know if they're gonna lay you off. You never know if like, oh, we gotta make some cuts and sorry, you're fired. You never know if the business is gonna go under, right? So if you give them the ability to feed you, you also give them the ability to starve you. So instead of trying to uh, spend your time and your effort to make money for somebody else, you should put that time and effort into your own business and don't do it like how we did it, okay? We were like serving people literally with our time and effort. We will do this thing for you. We discovered digital products. We built a digital product and this is insane, okay? We built this digital product, come with me back to the board and you're not gonna believe this, we put our digital product out there, okay? And in one week, guess how much we made in one week? We put our digital product out there. It was a coaching program. We made $400,000 in one single week. In fact, right behind me, right behind these cameras right here, I have multiple, multiple, multiple million dollar awards hanging on the wall to prove it. I wish I could turn the camera around, but the way it's all set up. But anyways, the point is this, like when we discovered, wait, 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 oh my gosh, this is insane. All we had to do was instead of like trading our time for dollars and putting in all this effort to like physically uh, and with our time and effort serve people, we could actually take that same time and effort, create a digital product. Again, here in just a moment, I'm gonna show you how it works. Create a digital product that solves the same problem for them to where I don't have to do it physically for them myself, right? And then this digital product, it does the heavy lifting for you. In fact, it was Warren Buffett, the billionaire, who said it like this. If you don't learn how to make money while you sleep, then you will work until you die. Now, I don't know about you, but I don't wanna have to work until I'm like 70, 80, 90 years old, if we even make it that long, right? Just working, working, working to make a little bit of money, right? It was at this moment for myself, for my wife, for our friends who had a very similar experience, it was through this experience that we began to discover it's easier to make a lot of money in a short amount of time than it is to make a little bit of money over a long period of time. Okay, now I know you might be watching right now and thinking like, wait a second, this that doesn't make any sense. It probably doesn't make sense because you might still be operating on this old operating system where all you know how to do to make money is to trade your time and your effort, okay? Hey, I hope you're enjoying the training. I wanted to take a few moments real quick to invite you to join me for my upcoming Create and Sell Digital Products five day challenge, okay? This is a five day live virtual event where I invite entrepreneurs or would be entrepreneurs just like you to come spend five days with me and get live training on the five moves that anyone can take in order to scale and skyrocket their business and their revenue. Now, the best way to join is as a VIP because VIPs get to spend an extra hour with me every single day and ask your questions live. My most successful students have all been VIPs. That's the best way to join. Listen, you don't wanna miss the upcoming Create and Sell Digital Products five-day challenge. It's completely live. It's coming up right around the corner. Click the link down below in the description. Grab your ticket today. Now back to the training. If your only context, if your only lens that you know how to make money is through, I'm gonna trade my time for dollars, then of course, this concept of it's easier to make a lot of money in a short amount of time than it is to make a little bit of money over a long period of time. Of course, that concept 
is like not computing, right? So what you need to do is pay very, very close attention because here in the next few moments, I'm gonna share with you a number of different digital products and even give you some numbers behind them of how you can take the knowledge, experience, expertise that you already have, plug them into these digital products, solve a market's problem with these digital products, and these digital products are just selling over and over and over. In fact, recently I went on vacation with my family. It was awesome. We went, we stayed for eight days. We were gonna stay for uh, six and we decided, you know what, let's just extend it for eight, why not? Because we could. And it was so crazy. While we were out there chilling on the beach, the kids are like throwing the Frisbee, everyone's eating snow cones. We're enjoying each other. It was absolutely amazing. While we were chilling on the beach, I made multiple six figures through my digital products. What? Listen, I'm telling you this right now. I'm not smarter than you, okay? I'm not better than you. I'm not more special than you. I have just figured out a better operating system than trying to trade my time for my dollars. So if you are ready, drop the words I'm ready down below in the comments. Say, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. And I'm gonna show you guys exactly how digital products can work for you. When I say you are only one digital product away from life-changing freedom, life-changing income, life-changing opportunities, I am not kidding, okay? Come with me here to the board and let me break it down for you, all right? So here's a couple of things that you need to consider first, okay? Before you create your digital product, the first thing you gotta do is you have to get clear on who you would like to serve, okay? Here's the biggest thing. A lot of people right now, especially if you're watching right now and you're like, oh, I don't even, I don't know who I would serve. I don't know what I would do. What you need to do, see the hardest work that most people are not willing to do is the think work. Okay, now before I go any further, don't hear what I'm saying and get it twisted like, oh, Rick said I'm just gonna think about it. And there's so many people out there, they don't experience success because they're always preparing to prepare to prepare to prepare, right? They, they get caught up in analysis paralysis. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about sit down and say, okay, what comes easier to me and maybe a little bit harder for others? What is something that I've done forever and ever and ever? And by the way, don't downplay yourself. I have students who are like single moms. I have people who are like in the hospitality industry. Like all I've ever done is work at a hotel. I don't know. And they've made tens of thousands of dollars. I have people literally who are like, they were tree farmers. And they're like, well, all I've ever done is like plant lemon trees. And they're making uh, tens of thousands of dollars, like it's it's crazy. I have seamstresses, like all I ever did was sew, I'm really good at sewing. Whatever you have done, whatever you have experienced doing, I want you to break the limiting belief right now that's like, I, I only X, Y, Z, or I've only done X, Y, Z, right? That's a limiting belief, okay? If you are even one step ahead of somebody else, in a specific area, maybe you're a mother right now. You're like, all I've done is being a, all I've done is be a mom. All you've done is be a mom. Like, there's so many new moms out there who would love to learn from someone who's raised two, three, four, five kids, right? Uh, maybe you're a guy out there, like, well, all I've ever done is like sell cars. Like, all you've ever done is sell cars. You've done it for 15 years. There are so many new salespeople out there who would love to learn from someone like you. Okay, so what you need to do is you need to get clear on who you would like to serve. Okay, sit down and go, okay, what comes easy to me, naturally to me, I have experience doing this, and maybe a little bit harder for others, and how can I serve them, okay? So that's the first step, get clear, because if you're not clear on how you can help people, they're not gonna be clear on how they can exchange value with you, and by the way, that leads me to the second thing. Number one, get clear on who you would like to serve, okay? Now that you've figured out who you'd like to serve, you need to Come up with an obvious solution to your market's obvious problem. And I would even say problems, right? Think about it, here's how business works, okay? Every single one of us, we have different problems, different things that we desire to get fulfilled, right? Um, man, I'm out of toothpaste, like that's a problem, right? Like, oh man, I need new socks, that's a problem. Oh man, I need to get my oil changed, that's a problem. Uh, I, my shirt has a hole in it, that's a problem, right? Like, oh, my back hurts, that's a problem. Oh, my tooth aches, that's a problem, okay? So every single one of us, 
are faced with problems every single day, or even the problem of like, oh man, I, I want a coffee, right? Like that's a problem. And all of us who have these problems, which is 100% of everybody around the world, we're looking for solutions to our problems. So now that you've gotten super clear on who you'd like to serve, you need to think, okay, what are the biggest problems that these people face? Okay, if you wanna get really, really good at digital products, really, really good at business, if you wanna get really, really good at serving people at the highest level so that they can begin to pay you at the highest level, you have got to know your market's problems better than they know that they need a solution. Think about that. Drop some fire emojis in the comments if you're getting what I'm saying, okay? You need to know your market's problems better than they know that they need a solution. Okay, you need to know this thing so well. Again, a car salesman. Maybe you're like, all I've ever done is be a barista. There's so many people who, lo who would love to become a barista who don't know where to start. They love to learn from you. Uh, there's so many new moms who would love to learn from you. There's so many, whatever, seamstresses. Um, you know, I even have farmers in my program. People are like, all I've ever done is being a farmer. And he, he made hundreds of thousands of dollars, right? So the point is this. Now that you're clear on who you wanna serve, Okay, the second thing you gotta do before you start your digital product is you have to come up with a solution to the problem that you identify. Okay, I know that this market really struggles with X, Y, Z problem. And I'm not just talking about like, you know, ow, I stubbed my, my pinky toe or ooh, my little finger hurts. I'm talking about their big problems that they're like, oh, this is like the biggest problem, the biggest pain. I really, really, really need some help with this. You wanna go after those kind of problems because when you do, and of course I'm talking in the context of you can actually help them with those problems, right? When you go after the bigger problems, guess what? The bigger problems pay bigger amounts of money. Okay, so if you go after little problems, they're gonna pay you little money. But if you go after big problems, they're going to pay you big money. Okay, so number two, come up with an obvious solution to your market's obvious problem. Now watch this, number three, this is where it starts getting juicy, okay? This is where it starts getting good. Okay, let me know down in the comments if you're ready for number three. Drop a three down in the chats, let's go. Okay, number three. Now that you've come up with an obvious solution to your market's obvious problem, you are going to create a digital product that solves that problem. Ta-da! Think about this, okay? So another quick story. So I have a student named Jared, okay? He just joined one of my programs recently and he didn't know anything about digital products, about digital marketing, about sales. Like he knew nothing about any of it. He jumped into my program, okay? He learned our blueprint, like, cause obviously I have only have so much time here in a YouTube training. Um, there's, there's layers to it, right? But I'm gonna, I'm gonna hook you up here in just a second with a bunch of different options that you can do. But anyways, he took our blueprint, he plugged his thing, he plugged his, who do I wanna serve into our blueprint. We showed him exactly how to create the products, exactly how to do it, exactly what to say, exactly what to do all across the board. He followed the yellow brick road, okay? And literally in the first week that he launched his digital product, he made $4,000. What? Like think about this, okay? Let me, let me just paint a scenario for you, okay? If he never got better, which obviously he will. Like all of us are gonna get better if we stick with something over a long period of time. So if he never got better and just stayed on the current trajectory that he's on right now and only made $4,000 a week for the rest of the year, this guy, Jared, my student, would literally make multiple six figures, over $200,000 in his first year with one digital product. Now let me submit something to you, okay? I want you to get excited. If you're excited, drop it in the comments. Say, I'm excited, I'm excited. Cause check this out, and you should be excited. This changed mine and my wife's life. It's changed a bunch of my friends' lives. It's changed my students' life, and it can change your life too. Check this out, okay? You should get excited because when it comes to digital products, imagine, that Jared's story, that was just one digital product. Imagine if you had two digital products. Imagine if you had, <gasps> five digital products. Imagine if you had 10 digital products. This is where this opportunity for digital products begins to snowball like crazy. And this is how you can begin to build insane, mind-blowing, outrageous wealth 
very, very quickly, especially when you disconnect your time and effort from your dollar and begin to connect your creativity to your dollar, okay? And when I say creativity, I'm talking about being creative to create these digital products that can solve people's problems for them even while you sleep, okay? Now come with me back here to the board and let me share with you a couple of digital products that are incredible, okay? One, ebooks, okay? I love ebooks. Ebooks are basically, they're a 10 page, 15 page uh, virtual book that you can literally take your phone, okay? And basically have a conversation with your younger self you three years ago, five years ago, 10 years ago, and say, listen, let's, let's say I'm doing it to myself. Hey, Rick, here's something that you need to know about business. Here's something that you need to know about digital products. The first thing you need to know is blah, 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 blah. The second thing you need to know is blah, 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 blah. You literally have this conversation with yourself on your phone recorder, okay? And then you're gonna take that, that recording and go to fiverr.com, okay? I have no affiliation with them, but I'm just giving you some game here. You're gonna go to fiverr.com and you're literally gonna take that to an ebook maker and say, hey, turn this into an ebook for me, please. It'll cost you like 50 bucks, maybe 100 bucks, and boom, now you've got an ebook and anytime you post any content or anytime you wanna help somebody, you can literally just say, yo, by the way, if you like this content, Check out my ebook. You could either give it to them for free in exchange for their name, email, and phone number, or if you wanna get fancy, you can sell them your ebook for seven bucks. Like, think about this. If you sold 10 ebooks a day, you could literally make $70 a day, okay? And if you did this every single day, it's an extra two grand a month. That's with one ebook. What if you had three ebooks? What if you have five? What if you have 10? You see what I'm saying here? Like guys, I'm telling you, this is absolutely out of control, okay? So eBooks, I love eBooks. Number two, courses, okay? So now the, the person on Fiverr who created your eBook for you, you can literally take the chapters, like I said, it's a 10 or 15 page kind of PDF digital document, right? An eBook, you've probably seen them, maybe you've downloaded them or purchased them before. But now you're literally going to take the chapters from the eBook and every chapter you can turn it into a module in a course. And by the way, you don't need like fancy lights and fancy cameras. You literally just take your iPhone, okay, and you go to Best Buy or Target and you buy a $20 ring light and you put your iPhone on there and you hit record. I've recorded many courses like this. And you just begin to talk through all of these different chapters from your ebook and turn them into modules in your course. And now you have a course that you could sell to people. Like for instance, let's say the people who are purchasing your ebook, okay, they're like, whoa, this is really good. Do you have something else? And you're like, matter of fact, I do. I have a course. It's only whatever, $500. And they're like, what? This is awesome. I would love your, your course. Let's say you sold um, five courses per day at $500 a day. Okay, if now we're talking here, that's $2,500 per day. And if you do this for a month, let me make sure I'm doing this right here. Five courses, <laughs> five courses at $500. Yeah, it's $2,500 a day. And if you do this for a month, you're making $75,000 a month. Let's say that like, it, you don't even, you're like, well, who's gonna do that? Let's just say you do that like half of that. Like would 30 grand a month change your life? Like this is the power of digital products, man. Let me give you a third one, okay? Third one. If you've made it this far into the training and you're enjoying it and you still haven't checked out my upcoming five-day live virtual challenge, Great and Sell Digital Products, what is you doing? Check out this testimony right here of one of my current students. He took the information that I'm gonna be sharing with you in the upcoming five-day training to make $15,000 in one single week. Click the link down below, join as a VIP. We'll see you in the challenge. Now, back to the training. Okay, eBooks courses. Mentorship programs, okay? I like mentorship programs because you can literally say, okay, guys, not only are you gonna get my ebook, not only are you gonna get my course, but I'm actually going to do a once a week group coaching call over Zoom where I'm literally going to coach you on the thing that I'm helping you to solve your problem for, right? And people love this. And the crazy part is with the coaching program, 
a me, sorry, a mentorship program, a coaching program, you could sell these for a thousand, you could sell them for three thousand, you could sell them for five thousand, ten thousand. I have coaching programs for my top end clients, they're a hundred thousand dollars, and people pay it. I have dozens of clients in that program. Like, it is mind blowing when you begin to discover the power of digital products, it is mind blowing just how fast everything can change for you. So here's what I wanna encourage you with, okay? I wanna encourage you to begin to start doing these three steps, okay? Now that you have these couple of digital products to think about, I want you to begin to start doing these three steps right now. I want you to number one, start getting clear on who you'd like to serve. Number two, I want you to come up with an obvious solution to your market's obvious problems. And then number three, I want you to say, okay, how can I, how can I solve those problems through an ebook, through a course, through a mentorship program? And then guys, here's the thing. No longer is your time and effort going to be connected to your dollar. Let me leave you with this thought today, okay? One of the reasons why people are limited in their income is because time and effort are limited. So guess what? If you're trying to make income with limited resources like time and, mon or time and effort, then guess what else is gonna be limited? Your money. But if you disconnect your time and effort from your dollar, and you begin to generate money with your creativity, okay, the creativeness that it takes to build an ebook, to create an, a course, to run a mentorship program. Guess what? Creativity is unlimited. So whenever your earning potential is connected to something that's unlimited, guess what else becomes unlimited? Your earning potential. Listen to me, guys. I'm telling you this right now. You are only one digital product away from the rest of your life becoming the best of your life. My question to you is, what you waiting for? Guys, thank you so much for watching this training. Make sure to like and subscribe, hit the bell, all that good YouTube-y stuff, and we'll see you in the next training.